there, to the sea, I tell you. Our salvation floats upon the briny blue. We must reach Engine's battleship and quickly before it sets sail. But how? Think, Cortex, think. <laughs> Okay, so hello again everyone, this is Marcus here with another video, where today we are actually doing a test. Because I am wanting to see how well uh, OBS works with PCSX2, which is a PlayStation 2 emulator for the PC, because I am hoping to soon be live streaming some PS2 games as well as some PS1 games, because I've actually never tried using OBS before with... Uh, with PCSX2, the PS2 emulator, I've only tried it with PS1 emulators, which it seems to work pretty good. I've got this set to 60 FPS right now, and I'm using the USA version of Crash to Insanity, a good old underrated Crash Bandicoot game. My third favourite Crash Bandicoot game, I will say, but anyway, uh, enough on that. So this is 60 FPS capturing, and the CPU usage seems to be really low. It only seems to be like at 3.3%. Uh, so that's how it's capturing right now, but it seems to be capturing very smooth. It's not dropping any frames at all. And this is just uh, recording, not live streaming. I'm not too sure how well it'll be perform when you live stream, but it should perform the same as recording. And I've always found that cutscene really funny, but anyway, uh, I'm hoping to soon live stream some games uh, for PS2 using OBS, so OBS is what I use for streaming and I'm using my usual microphone, the Zalman, is it ZM or ZM Mic 1, uh, just attached to my shirt. So hopefully you should be able to hear my voice quite fine because all I'm doing is just really doing this as a test video to make sure everything is all good and I am going to upload this because, I mean, I'd like to live stream and record some Let's Plays and this seems to be working a lot better than Fraps. I mean, why did I not think of this before? Because I know a couple, another YouTuber, uh, uh, Spiral Jonathan, I'll give you a shout out right there. I know you uh, struggle using OBS. I don't know what, why that is. It must be an OBS fault. But for me, it seems to work pretty well. I mean, this is my first time using OBS. Coming through! Oh. Ladies? Excuse me, madam. But for some reason, OBS seems to be capturing pretty smoothly. I think what I did was I changed the, uh, what's it called, the GPU or the encoder to the NVIDIA HVENC one, as opposed to the X246. I don't know if that's exactly got anything to do with it, but for some reason, OBS seems to work quite well. I mean, it's probably because I'm using the dedicated NVIDIA GPU, which mine is nowhere near as fast as even the baseline NVIDIA GPUs like the GTX 1050. Don't even come close. I mean, this is pretty slow pro that with NVIDIA. It's an 860M, 2 gigabyte, which is an old, pretty old graphics processor for a laptop because this is a 2014 gaming laptop. Well, it is a 2015 facelift, but it uses the uh, Maxwell GTX 860M which comes nowhere close to even the baseline GTX 1050, I mean. I could probably do with a new gaming computer one day, but I mean, CPU and GPU seem really low. I mean, if you open Task Manager right now, it's hardly using 40% of the GPU. And it's hardly using 20%. And this is 720p capturing, so I wonder if this will actually go pretty well. I mean, all I can do is really try it. Uh, because, I mean, I'd love to live stream PS2 as well as PS1 games. Uh, here comes this quick cutscene. I've never been so humiliated. No amount of treasure could ever begin to compensate. Treasure, I? Fonza. But I say everything seems to have gone smooth with this quick test recording uh, using OBS with uh, PCSX2. So 
Hopefully very soon I should be able to do some live streaming of some PS2 games. I hope everybody else who is having technical difficulty can probably uh, sort the problem soon because I know it must be really annoying. In fact, I might, I might be able to help you with that if you're just uh, asking. I might be able to do that uh, for you, give some tips, but unless just for some reason my OBS works really well and I'm just using OBS 23.1, just the regular OBS, not Streamlabs, but this seems to have gone pretty well, so hopefully uh, I should be able to live stream some PS2 games pretty soon, of which I have proved I can do, because I'd love to do Twin Sanity, so yes. This has been a quick tw Twin Sanity demo video, just to prove everything has gone smoothly, so I suppose that's that, so thank you so much for watching that. If this interested you, uh, I hope you enjoyed seeing this test video to see everything works, so it's something more to look forward to on the channel. So, apart from that, all I can really say is thank you so much for watching once again, and uh, goodbye, I will see you all in my next video or stream.